Hey guys, welcome back to another video from Quick Freezes Game. Today is going to be, oh man, this is going to be, <laughs> this is going to be a huge, massive pickup, uh, thanks to an uncle of mine. My uncle just called me probably about an hour ago, and he said, "Hey, Cliva, I got this huge collection of video games. I just went through my closet, and there they were. Uh, would you like to look at them?" And just like that, I'll be like, "Yes, I'll be right down." Not even blinking an eye, I jumped in my car and headed his way. So, if my my uncle's watching this, thank you very much. I deeply appreciate all the stuff that I'll be showing in this video. And honestly, I don't even know what all is in this bin. Uh, I went through it briefly. A few gems in there, a few things that I, I kind of like, uh, but I don't know what's fully in there. So, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead, get started on this video. You know, show you everything that's in this bin, and it's. It's just a huge, massive pickup, you guys. And again, if my if my uncle is watching this, I doubt he is. Thank you very much to him, and I, I really do appreciate it. So let's go ahead. Let's see what's in this bin, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, so this is it. This is the tub right here. Like I said, uh, I already kind of went through this a little bit, but not fully. So let's go ahead and just get started. Take off the cover. And sissy, right off the bat we got the NES Game Atlas. So let's take a look at this. This is, oh, it's like a whole bunch of maps. We got Super Mario Bros. here. Super Mario Bros. 3. I hope you guys can see this too. Oh, we got maps for Mega Man 2. Star Tropics. Oh my god, this is fantastic. Oh, we got maps for DuckTales for the NES. Maps for Chip and Dale. Maps for Ninja Gaiden. Ninja Gaiden 2. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh man, yeah. That, that's fantastic. That's great. I never had this book in my life, and now... Heck, now that I have it, that's fantastic. We got, uh, we got another book here, Nintendo Strategies. What is this? Uh, it looks like it's just kind of like a a tip guide for a whole bunch of games. We got Contra here, Legend of Zelda, Metroid, 1943, Renegade. Oh my God! Look at yeah, that's fantastic. Spy Hunter. So another fantastic game guide. Oh my God! Look at this. this is we got uh, another game guide here. This is this looks like a strategy guide for Super Mario Brothers 3. Yeah, it looks like a strategy guide for Super Mario Bros. 3. That is fantastic. Missing the cover though, but you know, what can you do? It's been sitting in a closet for how many years, so. Okay, what do we got here? We got the four-way adapter, the four-player adapter. That is awesome. This is kind of heavy. I didn't think it would be that heavy. Okay, let's put that over there. We got the zapper, the orange zapper. So, yep, we got a zapper. Uh, controllers, hookups. Okay, so we got all that. Uh, let's see, we got Wrecking Crew, the game. Fantastic game. Play this a lot when, with my dad. So, uh, we got the NES right here. A little dirty on the front, but just kind of clean that up. Should be working fine. Okay, now we got a whole bunch of stuff here. Okay, we got a whole bunch of game manuals, you guys. We got manuals for Sesame Street ABC. So that's cool. Manual for Kirby's Adventure. Look look at the art, you guys. Look at the art in this thing. You don't you don't see art in game manuals anymore. We got the game instructions for Hunt for Red October. That's cool. Game manual for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Seriously, look at look at the art. That is awesome. You don't you don't see art in game magazines anymore or game instructions anymore. Okay, we got the art for the Legend of Zelda. Check that out. 
anybody wondering what that <laughs> that car noise is, that would be my brother returning home. Let's see, we got the game cartridge for Commando with the instructions. Fantastic. So, let's see, we got Super Mario Bros. 3. Cool game. Sesame Street ABC. Let's see, we got fantastic game. We got Kickle Cubicle for the NES with the instructions. This is a great game, guys. If you guys have never played this game, check it out. Fantastic game. Okay, then we got, let's see, Adventures of Dino Ricky for the NES. Uh, let's see, Metroid, the gray sticker. Uh, let's see, what do we got? Okay, we got an NES cleaning kit. Kind of cool. Always need these things. So. It's kind of neat. Always could use that. Ah, oh, look at that. Uh, Game Genie. Fantastic. I don't even have one, but now I do. Okay, here's the game guy for Adventures of Dino Ricky. Okay, let's see. We got we got a whole bunch. Of, okay, we got Super Mario Brothers 2 with the game manual. Kind of neat. Let's open that again, guys. Look at look look at the the art. You don't see these in video game uh, manuals anymore. You, you just don't. I'm impressed by how the art. Okay. Oh, we got the. The game instructions for Game Genie. This is where you get all the codes. Back then, we didn't have the internet. We had to look it up in books. Okay, we got the instruction manual for the Adventures of Link. That would be Zelda 2, if you guys don't know. Again, look at the art. Okay, look at this thing. We got the box for Final Fantasy. Check that out. It's a little busted up a little bit, but the game's inside. And also comes with the instruction manual. Look how thick this instruction manual is. Look at that. Look at that. That's crazy. Look at you just don't. Look at all the art in there, you guys. That's it's almost like a mini strategy guide. That that's fan this is probably the gem in this thing so far. I don't know what else is in here, but that definitely is the gem so far. Instructions for Duck Hunt and Super Mario Brothers 1. Even this, even though it's not colored, it still has pictures, you guys. Uh, what is this thing? We have... I don't know what this is, you guys. What is this? This is... What does it say? This says... Uh, Nintendo NES Satellite Receiver. If anyone knows what this is or what it does, please tell me. I have no idea what this does. So, the Satellite Receiver. Okay, uh, we got a whole bunch of stuff. We got games in here, you guys. Let's go through the games. The, right here, this is all instruction manuals you got. Uh, Legacy of the Wizard, um, Monster Truck Rally, uh, To the Earth. Um, I don't know what this one is. Astro something. Uh, let's see, look at this. We got the, the map. This is the map for the Legend of Zelda. It's a little brittle. But what can you expect after being in a closet for how many years? Uh, what is this? We got, look at this. The Final Fantasy Dungeon Maps. That is fantastic. I really want to open this up. Okay, and then on the other side, look, magic, weapons, armor, all that guy. Ugh. But yeah, there's the maps for all the dungeons and Final Fantasy. Simply fantastic. Okay, what is this? We got another set of maps here. We got another Final Fantasy. This is the map of the overworld. Fantastic. This is great. And look, then we got like a monster guide here. I hope you guys can see this very well. But yeah, we got a monster guide. That is epic. Okay, now we got games here. Okay, we got the Adventures of Link, which is Zelda 2. Uh, Sesame Street Countdown. Never played it. Uh, Nor North versus West. I'm not sorry. North versus South. This is a fantastic game, you guys. If you guys never played this game, 
Highly, highly recommend it. Great game. I don't own it, but now I do. Okay, we got Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back with the game a manual. So that is awesome. Kind of opens up like a, like a poster. So that's kind of neat. Okay. Uh, let's see. We got Fisher Price Perfect Fit. We got a whole bunch of these black sleeves, of course, which is awesome because I don't really have that many. Okay, we got the Legend of Zelda, the gold cart. We got Monster Truck Rally. We have the instructions for that already I showed you. Let's see. Okay, we have Dr. Mario with the instructions. Awesome. I'm really liking... I'm really liking the fact that these games are coming with the instructions. We got Hunt of Red October. Again, we had the instructions earlier on. Uh, we got the Legacy of the Wizard. We had the instructions for that one. I've never played that one. Uh, let's see, we got Yoshi with the instructions. Awesome. Put that aside. Let's see. Uh, let's see, we got the Iron Sword Wizards and Warriors 2. Awesome. I never played that one, so that'll be a good treat. Uh, we got uh, G.I. Joe, the Atlantis Factor. Cool. Uh, let's see, we have To the Earth. We had the instructions for that earlier. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I have this game already, but it's cool to have another one. Let's see. Of course, we have Super Mario Ver and Duck Hunt. Everyone has this game. But I also have the instructions for it now, too. Okay, we have Sesame Street 1, 2, 3. Um, honestly, guys, this is actually a really good game. When, uh, when I was a kid, I used to play this one and ABC all the time. And they're actually good games. There's two games in each cartridge. And I, I recommend them. Obviously, now, if you play them... They're not really that entertaining, but uh, still great games. Batman for the NES with the instructions. The cover's missing, but still. Oh, I have it upside down. But still, we got the instructions for Batman. Great. That's awesome. I know I said this already, but I'm really liking the fact that these games are coming with the instructions. Double Dragon 2 with the instructions fantastic never really liked double dragon 2 i like double dragon 3 which i hear is from a lot of people uh they don't like that game but i like it uh we have ghostbusters for the nes again with the instructions you guys this is fantastic i'm loving the fact that half of these are coming with instructions mickey mouse capade for the nes um Okay, what is this one? We have... I don't know, what is this one? This one's Archon, Archon. I don't know, but it comes with the instructions. So that's cool. I'll have to try this game out because I know nothing about it. Never even heard about it before. Blaster Master. Fantastic game. If you guys don't own Blaster Master, get it. Uh, let me see. We got Kirby's Adventure. I don't even have this game, and I'm a huge Kirby fan, so Kirby's Adventure. I think uh, the instruction manual came somewhere in this tub. I have to look for it. Uh, King's Knight. Uh, let's see. Ultima. I never played Ultima before, so that's cool. A lot of games in here that I don't have. Let's see. Sky Shark. Never played this one, but again, comes with the instructions, so... I'm really digging the fact that these are coming with instructions. Skate or Die. It's kind of like a standard in all NES collections, but I don't have this. But now I do. So Skate or Die. Fantastic. And the last game is... What is this? This one is Secret Service for the NES. And again, comes with the instructions. So, And last thing we got here is kind of like, um, you know, a... Uh, uh, case or a holding you know like a game case or whatever so uh but that is you guys that is the huge massive pickup 
of all this stuff and I'm just I'm blown away like if you're looking right now just the the, the three game guides all the games and pretty much like 90% of the games come with the instructions which is ah it's just it's fantastic and like I said earlier on in the video the prize gem in this tub I think is the boxed uh, Final Fantasy it has all the maps it has all the game guides it's just, oh yeah it's just fantastic but yeah there you guys go there is the huge massive pickup that my uncle gave me and again if he's watching this video and I I assume he he's he's not uh, thank you, thank you so much. This is fantastic. I'm gonna have to go ahead and I'm I'm pretty much gonna spend the entire day looking at those game manuals because the art in them is just fantastic. But again, guys, that's it. That's the the huge massive pickup for the NES that I required today. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you later. Goodbye.